all right my people welcome back on to this one well this is another one reaching us right now well on to this there's been a lot of reactions though on to this it says it says i can't speak yoruba fluently but i won a seat in ogun state assembly this had been said by buruji kashamu's son all right this is another strong one reaching us i can't speak yoruba very well but i won a seat in ogun state assembly buruju kashamo's son had revealed to ross all right my brother my sister <laughs> this is so serious it's not funny anyway but a lot of people will be like okay yes this man now if you compare him to badebo you will understand that he is better than badebo well according to what had been gathered buruju's kashamo's son had made it clear that though he cannot speak yoruba fluently but finally he won a seat in ogun state onto this some moments ago a correspondent of the punch newspaper had an interview with late senator buruji kashamu's 26 year old son abdul rashid kashamu who spoke about his journey into politics abdul rashid kashamu said according to him i quote i can't speak yoruba language very well but i want a seat in ogun state assembly now i will be representing the people of Ijebu North constituency one he added my inability to speak the language and then when in the context shows that anyone can become anything in their respective zones speaking further abdul rashid kashamu said i want people to know that governance is not about age everyone knows my late dad and then i am following his footsteps which people are satisfied with the moment they announced me the winner i went straight to the collation center with a sigh of relief because it was not easy he added my upbringing was normal and then basic and then as a family we had great principles and then expectations i began schooling in lagos but later went to complete my education outside nigeria again the lawmaker elect said sincerely my father's role in politics helped me and then i want to sustain his legacy i want the people of my constituency to expect youth empowerment assistance of small scale businesses and then improvement in the information and communication technology i will provide i will improve their businesses through constructive legislature lastly buruji kashamu's son said before the election getting the trust of the elders in the community was not easy they expected me to explain and then showcase what i have to offer i had lots of critics during the time the fact is that i am experienced i have worked at a bank outside nigeria and then also worked in a firm in nigeria all right and then exactly what is words are wow what a age 26 years of age and meanwhile he had made it clear that it is not by age yes it is not by your age to govern uh, a state or any any position given to you right now well a lot of people actually reacted in different forms and then they you know they compared this man with the last governorship candidate of the labor party talking about badebo and then onto this one they have been of the opinion that well you can never compare yourself to badebo that you are better off badebo that's what somebody had actually talked about him well according to modukwe adekola on this one says well nigerians will protest jonathan removing subsidy to 140 but will see it as normal when buhari makes it 142 then 145 then 165 now 165 the same way they will say badebo can't speak yoruba fluently so he is bad for lagos but rashid kashamu is good it is simply called hypocrisy all right that's exactly what had been said by mudukwa dekola on this one well someone is also saying that well my dear you are better than badebo so forget about that all right so and the kemi has made it clear that your upbringing is different from chinedu you respect 
the elders and then thinking yorubas okay i think that's another one the yoruba people the people have actually seen to this well you did not claim your constituency is not a no man's land either good luck anyway all right i think i quite understand um, where a lot of people are actually driving out on this aspect and then i must still say this again a lot of people have not checked after the controversy of the lagos no man's land and all that and then after which a lot of people are not like way to in all our findings in all our researches we never we have never heard or we have never seen anyone who actually made that statement that uh, that went viral that they, they did not see anybody who talked about the fact that lagos is no man's land that that strategy actually came from bola men to Numbu. that that is why <laughs> You will have to respect Bola Mentunu, but when it comes to politics, in fact, he's a father of politics. He had calculated everything that, oh, now that you know, it's like all the Yorubas are trying to, you know, campaign. They are even, they were campaigning for Peter Obi, the Labour Party, to which Labour Party actually won the, you no know, state, won Lagos during the presidential election. So he now calculated that, could it be that the Yoruba people, are now for the egos and now for peter obi so the next thing he quickly calculated it and they re strategized to the fact that the egos are claiming they are coming to take over lagos so if you people like they could go for victim they could go vote for them at the end of it all the yoruba were not like ah total money are you serious oh so that's what they are trying to do then we have to reverse but even at it all we noticed everything that happened was not you no know, the actual result anyway so what exactly are we actually talking about you no know, talking about the fact that you no know, some set of people were saying lagos is no man land and all that 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 one should be erased from everybody's mouth that nobody had actually talked about that though the people are like oh this man is better than bad day boy well we'll say very big congratulations to him anyway i think for, for me his age for me anyway i love his age and then um, right now old sky says it all depends on child's upbringing the rich children who schools abroad or in some of our private schools may not understand or know how to speak their native language obama can't speak kenya but became world's largest all right, I think this is uh, this is coming straight. Became the world's largest democratic country. Our children must not become an outcast for not speaking our language. After all, we'll send them to those. Okay, we send them to those schools. The language many of our children understand are tech language, financial language, and then entrepreneurship language. All right, that's another one. Well, okay. Nobody will doubt your sincerity to better the lot of the people you are representing. Your father's name is an household name in Southwest politics. Above all, you are ready to learn by starting from the House of Assembly. All right, that's another one. Okay, well, according to guess, well, Abu Rashid wrote on his father's game to state assembly well it was a transferred interest road two will get there someday grv started the race himself without enough political backup unlike the former let him be president all right well my brother i think we quite understand this well to me with what i have seen to this is that eh, we should as no as a matter of fact as a matter of urgency as our people try as much as possible to come together try as much as possible to you know love one another as far as this country is concerned the way nigeria is a country full with milk and honey but the fact remains that greed wickedness had made a lot of the leaders to you know you no know, cause to be causing ethnic issues right now and then if care is not taken, a lot of things will get destroyed. So right now, even the Yoruba Nation agitators were of the opinion that it's only prayer that can make anything work right now. So what do you think about this? That's exactly what we have been telling ourselves. We all need to 
come together in love or else let everybody go in separate ways all right my people this is exactly what it is right now on to this one what more can we say me well let me have your own take on this and remember to subscribe for more updates if you are new on this channel all right thanks and god bless